Atlanta is a mecca for wealthy African Americans. Let's go, come on. Oh, did you just wipe sweat on my face? We here. I'm ready to go ninja assassin on you. <laughs> Don't make that face. That's hilarious. Okay. I'm about to revolutionize. She's over red. She's chopping all the silliness, the pettiness. Can't take a seat, so sick of it, the struggling. Mm. The shadiness, the faking it, can you see it? She's over it, yeah, yeah. Oh my God, I freaking love that, Lauren. <laughs> Do you? So you helped write that? I wrote it, Renee went and tweaked it. Uh -huh. So, you know, we both, we co-wrote it. Uh, I'm excited. Mm -hmm. Shorts. <laughs> it. It's sparkling the whole nine yards. Yeah, whatever. That's right, girl. All right, well, have a seat. You know, it's very informal. This was kind of last minute. I decided to do this. Hello. Yes, Miss Leach. Oh, Miss Leach. Go Hollywood. Go Hollywood. Go Hollywood. Yes, Go Hollywood. Hi, 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 Sit down, sit down. I'm super stressed. I got to leave to go to Los Angeles. But tonight, Cynthia's throwing me a cocktail party, so I got to find the energy because Cynthia's my girl. Nene, what, huh. would you like something to drink? I have um, beer. I have wine. I'm going to have me some wine. Huh? Oh, Lord, Craig Leakes. <laughs> when you go to L.A., Todd told me to tell y'all that we'll come visit y'all. He said, one, make sure that Greg will be there so he don't be the only guy. <laughs> I am so happy to see Nene and Greg back together. It's great to see him and Nene moving together as a family. It's great to see that she has that rock, that person who's been there for her forever. So have you started taping yet? We have been doing like promos and stuff. Are you scared? No. How long you got tape for? I don't know. I know I'm going to be there at least a couple months. I think it's going to be exciting. Wait. Hi. Got one over here. Hello. Hey. Hi, everybody. How are you? Thank you look good. We haven't seen each other. I know. I'm your dress. I have missed you. You look cute. I have missed you. Hey. Portia is still a little upset about all the drama between her and Kenya. She does really want to say something, but I don't think that she wants to mess up this gathering for Nene. How are you over to my butt? Hey. You know we have the same girl. I had a tough marriage. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is for our guest of honor. Thanks, I called Christian Lubbins and he said you had everything. So. Oh, oh my God, baby, how oh. thoughtful! Oh. Look at us. Oh. Oh my God. She said it's from all of us, and they just something. That is a really good one too. Just in case you all remember us. Oh. Thank you so much. You know what? This is getting too crowded. Guys, let's go in the dining area. I'm not surprised to see Kenya here without Walter, because lately it seems like Walter enjoys the company of our husbands more than hers. It feels much lighter over here, now that it's crowded. So what are you going to do in Harlem when you get out there, man? I got a deal working with a couple of real estate companies out there already. Yeah. Let's get that down. Julio jumping off, though. Let's do it. You know, this party is for you and your wife going away. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Cheers on that one. Cheers. Thank you. Right there. That's what I'm talking about. I'm walking around in my neighborhood. I'm getting my little groceries and everything. And then finally I'm checking out and the guy goes, um, can I ask you a question? Are you Beyonce? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Somebody thinks I'm Beyonce. <laughs> you don't look like Beyonce. I'm sorry. I don't know who told you that to try to get in your panties, but it's not true. I was at the inauguration, and it was just like 100 people in line just trying to take pictures with me. It grew from five people to six people to 10 people to 100 people wanting my autograph and to take photos. I'm thinking, these people don't know me. I'm sure of it. I look like Solange. 
I can see you that. You see that? I can see that. Now y'all see that. Emancipated. Kenya thinks she looks so much like Beyonce. Why can't she get her man to put a ring on it? You know, I live up the hills for five years in Birdland. That's where we're going, on yeah. bikini. Uh, yeah, I used to run the Source Magazine Entertainment Division. Come up and show me the ropes. Yeah, I had fun out there. Because at the time I was dating Neil Long. All right, and she was a big Hollywood star. She was an it girl out there. Now, y'all out there on some different level. I mean, your wife is on two hot shows. And even though, like, the new norm is a new franchise coming out there with the people that's attached to it, I think it's going to be a home run. And I'm hoping. Let's do another shot. You going to do another shot? Another shot. Are you going to man up? Do another shot, dude. Oh, whatever, Stop talking. Dude. Be about it. <laughs> He's trying to call somebody out. Here you go. You wanna get my it's gonna be real funny when Nene's picking your ass up off the floor. You about to be Hollywood, baby. Cheers. Gotta drink some water. Gotta go drink some water. Please, I need everybody to grab some champagne. All right, I would like to make a toast to my girl Nene Leaks. Nene Leaks, you have been doing your thing. Oh, thank you so much. Like, you're doing so much that I can't even keep up at this point. This moment means a lot to me. They've all decided to put any differences that we've had aside and be here to celebrate me and my success. Congratulations, Nene. I've never had anything against Nene. I've always wanted the best for her. I'm excited for Nene's success and her newfound career in LA. If she hangs over close to this side, if I feel like she Sorry. can make it. Kenya's thinking, like from what we can see, you want to come out and look, then you can you can make it up. No, I can try it. She don't think she can do it. You want me to try it? Oh. Kenya's a really good driver. Do you mind if she tries? If you break, you gotta pay for it. Cynthia, I'm coming down. I'm coming down. Okay, I'm, I'm out. I'm outside of the truck. If you don't go to the top of the hill, how do you know you, there's no option for you to come down? It's a pretty long flight to LA, and then it's taking forever to get to this house. She's coming down. So why are we still trying to get her to do something? These bitches are really being disrespectful. It's good night. It's crazy. Don't just come showing up like, like, bitch, it ain't a problem. It's a dinner, 9 o'clock. How dare you show up at almost midnight and think that you coming up in here? Now, you got me real messed up. Uh-oh. Does that thing come out anymore? <laughs> Thank you. It's midnight. It's crazy. Yeah, you go Cute. first. Oh, God. <laughs> why me? Wait, wow. wait, wait for the other girl. Oh, no. Oh. We're doing a sit-in. I don't give a what y'all doing. I'm dead much serious. It's going on midnight. It's, we're not in Angola. We're not in Africa. We're at my home, and it's just up. What you gonna need to do is exit to the left. And so we're gonna say good night. Nice to see y'all. You look great. <laughs> you, you guys well, are tired. Come you, on, Kenny. No, you're, you're, oh, you're not here for me now. No, Hold you're on. here because we're here. Oh, oh no, you're not. Because if you were here for me, you'd have been here long before midnight now. Just when I thought the crunk Nene was dead and buried in Hollywood, I guess she has resurrected. You come into my home and I have a child and everything. We understand. I don't spend money on folks and thousands for people to serve y'all. That bullshit, them people's packing up, ready to go. Right. Nobody in this group, let's be candid, is ever on time. I feel that on a level, it's a bit disrespectful. You know how you feel. No, no, no. We understand this late. Not only that, I'm preparing for a huge scene this week. So I ain't even trying to be funny, but I'm keeping it 100 with y'all. Good night. And that's for real.
Bye bye. No, I did it. It's not even cool. It don't work like this. Right. Okay. You don't disrespect people and have them spend this kind of money to prepare a place yeah. for you. I sure wish we could just get us a little box to go or something.